Hello and uh, welcome to the Geeky Creativity Q and A. Um, I have no idea how this looks because I just bought a new webcam and uh, I, it could look terrible. It's a 720p camera and my and I'm hoping it looks good. Um, but yeah, I will constantly be looking into the screen because the camera is over there and I, my screen is over there. But um, let's start this. So. Um, Let's look for the questions here. Uh, there was one. Okay. The Sacromancer, hope I'm uh, pronouncing that the correct way, asks, where are you from originally? Nowhere. Because I've only lived in one country my entire life, and that's uh, Iceland. Um, I'm Icelandic. And by my accent and guess looks you wouldn't really think that because I've heard a lot of people confuse me with someone else or from a different I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore <laughs> yeah, great start uh, but yeah I'm from Iceland uh, but my mom is French so I'm half French um, yeah um, Simon Reiber asks Hope I'm pronouncing that the correct way again. Good job. And for the question, how did you learn to work with wood and make awesome swords and stuff? I didn't. There wasn't a single place I learned everything. That's my dog barking. But yeah, it wasn't a single place. It is just through experience. Uh, that might sound... Oh, of course, blah, 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 you know, give me a better answer. But really, that is, you know, that is how I learned. Just by getting a piece of wood and uh, using my belt sander to make it look like a sword. That's basically how I learned to make a sword. Um, let's see. Um, Ragland asks, how old are you? I'm 18. Well, this year. After, what, two or three months? October? I don't even know. <laughs> I'm not great at math. <laughs> but, yeah, 18. Let's just say that. Um, let's, let's see. Um, Neil Kirkland asks, How long does it take you to make something? Two weeks. Technically, over the oh, two weeks over the span of a month. So I don't work every single day on a video. I might work one week, then the last week in a month. Uh, like, let's say I'm making a video in September. I might work the first week of September and the last week of September. Or I might work the first week, just three days in the first week and then a single day in the next week and just kind of it's two weeks in in the span of a month technically um because i'm extremely busy <laughs> i i have a life god damn it my dog is barking um uh, i'm seeing a lot of questions here about uh, let's put this can you slash will you make questions uh there are a bunch of i'll put them on the screen um, there's the Ciro's mask from Code Geass, um, Axel's, I don't even know how to pronounce that, um, yeah, bunch of things, yes, that's the answer, yes, I have a Word document on my computer with every single request, and I think it's about three pages now, so I have a lot to do. So, the answer is yes, at some point. I don't know when. It could be three years from now, but yes. <laughs> Best answer ever. Um, oh, here's a friend of mine. Yaz Creative asks, Awesome, congrats on 500 subs. Question, what is your dream geeky creativity project you want to do in the future? That's a difficult one. Um, because gig creativity, it's, it's just a start. Like this, 
this is nothing. Like, truly, this is nothing now, but I'm hopefully in the future will become something. <laughs> but um, Dream Geek Creativity Project. Um, if you're talking about a video, I'd say I would like to make like a parter, a video that's of just a bunch of parts. And I'd like to make it with a bunch of people. Um, and that project would would probably be a radio-controlled R2-D2. If you just look that up, you'll understand from a prompt maker's perspective, that is like the the best project or the final thing you do. Like, th at that point, you're going towards, like, bigger things. Um, but, it, yeah. Um, but a Geek Creativity project, I guess, um, if I would make a video out of it, like a one video, not a parter, I'd say, I, because uh, Yaz, I know you, you're a Hoovian. Uh, I'd say K9. And I would just like buy a radio control car and like make it just a K9 shell and put on top of it. That would be awesome. I need a K9. I want a K9. That's <laughs> behind the scenes how every video happens. I want a Pokeball. I'm going to make myself a Pokeball. I want a butterfly knife. I'm going to make myself a butterfly knife. Literally how every video happens. Um,. Olimar, Olimar, asks, do you have pets? Yes. Three. Uh, I don't know if you can see that because I can't see myself on the screen because I'm reading. Um, I have uh, two cats. Technically, I own one because my sister owns one of the cats, but it's kind of ours now. Uh, and one dog. But yeah, two cats, adorable kit cats, kittens, cats. Well, one is a kitten technically, and the other one is a fat, fluffy white ball. <laughs> so uh, one cat is named um, Chloe. That's the little cat, and uh, one is called Pinocchio. Well, he's named something else in Icelandic, Pussy, and uh, yeah, but. I like to translate it into Pinocchio. Um, fun fact, he was actually born uh, when Eyjafjallajökull um, erupted. So that's why he was called Gose, because Gos, Gos actually means, well, Eldgos means volcanic um, lava, you know, eruption. So it's, it's a fun thing, but... You know, it's a, it's a pun, basically. <laughs> his name is a pun. This guy found his name and named him. Um, yeah. I guess that's all the questions. Well, all right then. I think I really do believe these are all the questions. I think I've answered all of them. Um, yes. I have. So, um, thanks for watching. Um, this was just something i done, I've never done before, uh, but I'd like to do this again. This was a lot of fun uh, because I feel important. I, I shouldn't say that at this point. Uh, but yeah, it, it actually, um, I just want to say this. Uh, 150 subscribers from the point I got 500 and till now when this is being recorded. Um, but yeah, that's great. It was a lot of fun. I'd want to do this again at some point. I don't know when, but yeah, it it was fun. It was fun hearing that you guys were actually interested in something different than, you know, just creativity like uh, how old are you and do you have pets that's kind of funny like I <laughs> I would never have thought that that would be a question or questions but yeah it was a lot of fun 
I don't know how to end videos. I guess I just end them by um, looking into the camera and say, thanks for watching.